having a feedback? You having a feedback? You having a feedback, Captain? You having a feedback? You having a feedback? You having a feedback, Captain? You having a feedback, Captain? So yeah, the Windows noise, you heard it, I'm not proud of it, but hey. <coughs> you know, I don't give a fuck. Welcome back everyone. Welcome back. Um. Ah, oh, wonderful. See Aaron's face is very late one for me tonight. I'm gonna stream for about an hour and a half. Uh, it wouldn't be the quickest, as you know, or as you can deduce from the title. Five years ago today, we lost the one, the only Fred Gordon Herbert, a man who brought joy to many, many hundreds of thousands, if not millions, of people all around the world. So today we're going to be honouring him. <coughs> uh, a quick 
Uh, I don't know if he'll listen to this after, but uh, a quick message to Resistor Radio. Um, my condolences for him. He's recently had a loss in his life, so uh, I hope you're doing well, Resistor. I have no idea if you'll listen to this, but I was really sorry to hear about it. I hope you're doing well. Hope you're hanging in there, man. Um, I hope this will bring you some joy. Am I speaking too softly? Am I? I think I was quite far away from the mic. How's this now? How is this now? Is this all right? Can you hear me? Fred, I, I'm of the opinion, personally, I'm of the opinion that Fred is dead. And not that he faked his death. But everyone's entitled to their own opinion. Woohoo, just in time. He died in Costa Rica. It was something like that. Did he? No, he didn't die. All right, okay, well, th whatever the fuck. Um, let's get to the calls honouring this great man. Oh, hey, Peekaboo, man. What's up, brother? How the fuck are you, bro? I could check out Peekaboo. Funny channel. Um, Sleepyhead, as per, has sent me fucking about 20 bloody numbers over the past few hours. Ooh, Mr. Dennis Jaceev. Hey, Kimball, I uh, just wanted to take a moment to thank you on behalf of the entire community. I think it's a beautiful thing what you and the captain have been doing over there, and I really, really hope you'll be able to bust these guys tonight. I, I know that there's a lot on the go for you, but you have the full support of everyone in the department. I know you're going to be able to find these callers who've been leaving lewd and lascivious messages on this number. Unbelievable. Also, little side note, brother, as a personal favor for me, and maybe as a special treat for some of the viewers, do you think you could pull out an old soundboard for us? Specifically, one of the Iron Sheik, because that fucking maniac has some lines that are just gold. So if there's any angry people you might be able to call, I'm sure the Iron Sheik would be able to ruffle just the right feathers. Cheers, brother. Have a good one. Woo! Cheers, Dennis. Always lovely to hear from you. Smash that like button yet, yeah, Feral Farmer. Oh, well, god damn. Ain't that about a bitch. I just checked online. I can't even find a fucking Iron Sheik soundboard that works. Hopefully you have better luck than I do. If not, all good, brother. But I do hope you're having a fucking awesome day over there. Let's kick off the weekend right. Can't wait to watch the stream, buddy. Cheers. Woo! Dennis Jaceev coming in the hot. Cheers, Dennis. That's Ryan Seacrest. Sounds like Ben Stiller. Does kind of sound like Ben Stiller. Then we've got Anson Chigurh, Ben Stiller, Ryan Seacrest. Um, right. I think to start off, we should order some pizzas with uh, with Fred. I have this number saved that I believe is a pizza restaurant. Oh, fuck. I need to open that soundboard. Thanks for reminding Lisa, me. how can I help you? Hello? Oh, they won't even be able to hear this. Ugh. I forgot to set that up, but thanks for reminding me about that. Uh, brownie. Brownie, brownie, brown finger. Never did explain why you have a brown finger, did you? I really would like to know why you have a brown finger. Should we be concerned? Should I be concerned? Uh, hate how it resets my settings. It makes me angry, guys. It makes me want to punch something. It makes me just want to fucking put a hole through my wall. That's how angry it makes me. God, we went on fucking wild goose chase last time trying to find this cash line. Oh, Jesus. Kish. 
Um. Oh fuck. This is not this is going to take a while. I have a feeling that it may take a while. Fuck it, I'm gonna re it would actually be quicker just to mix another cash really quick. Pump the pump. Kimble, you like discipline. Just drop a like, be back later, Kimble. See you later, busy. I do not like discipline. Uh, okay. Cash. How did I make the cash line? Carry. Yeah. Carol? Oh, that's better. Carol? Carol? Say yes. 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 Carol. 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 Does that sound like cash to you guys? Does it sound like cash? Can you try the numbers I sent yesterday? We'll try, Wolf. You use the phrase, I can't. It doesn't. Kish. It sounds like kish. I'll, <laughs> I can say I'll give you a kiss. Kish. Yeah, it does sound like kish. I don't know, but I feel like in the context of the pizza, you'd think that was cash. What line did I use for a farmer? The phrase, I can't. I can't right now. OMG. People who say that on Tumblr. I can't. Where's it that I can't? I, is it I can't believe? I can't give you an answer on that. I think it is. It? I can't. I can't. Yeah, it was that one. It was definitely that one. Can't. 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 Cash. What did I use this? Is this your way of getting out of your responsibilities? Mm. That's me. Say yes, please. 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 Yeah? Yes. 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 Hmm. Please. Yes. What do we think? Please or yes? Oh, walnuts. Use one of his ah uh, lines. <coughs> What's his ah uh, lines? Please. Please. Yeah, he doesn't everything. Sure. I, I I don't understand why you're so mad at me, sir. Nah. Please. Yeah, I think please too. Please. Please. Yes. 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 Cash. Yeah, that's the good old cash. Cash. Uh, and we could even modify this to make it say cash. -er, and we could call some record store or something. I don't fucking know. What do you want? What do you people want from me? Cash. Cash. Uh. What does anti venom call when he has where he says he has the AI lines? <clears throat> and he's like, uh, Mike and the mechanics. In Arnold's voice. Come on, soundboard. Why can't I open my fucking soundboard? I just think so. something's going, something's wrong. That's mad. Oh, don't tell me I deleted my soundboard. Oh, I cleaned up my PC today. I hope I didn't actually delete my soundboard.
Uh oh. <laughs> I may have done the lead EXP sample. Uh oh, there's. Uh oh. Alright, don't panic, but I think there's a blank space on my desktop where I used to keep it. Fuck. Uh oh. Cash. Amigo, I want to give you a number of all music. Email it to me, bro. Check the description. If you want to send a number. Uh, check the script. Cash. Say yes. Oh no, I. Oh no. Oh, I think I deleted it, boys. Fuck, okay. Hopefully, this is just a quick down exe download. This is a dodgy looking fucking. It's got one of those like badges where it says virus free. Like, okay. I mean, I assumed it would be. God, it's a fucking exe file. Is there a review page? <laughs> if the stream goes offline now, you know what's happened. There's ransomware on my PC. I oh, know it worked. It's just taking. Did it? It worked! Oh, and it saved my soundboard from before. Oh, da. <coughs> right, that's fantastic. Me. I'm happy. I couldn't be happier. Because I have... Cash. Yeah, bitch. Cash, cash, money. Let's do this thing. Let's do this. Let's hit them. Let's hit them where it hurts. Right in the... Cash. Right in the cash. How can I help you? Hello? Hello? Yeah, I'll take the pepperoni with extra cheese, please. Did, is that Placing something you want to do? Or delivery, hon. Excuse me? Are you placing an order for pickup or delivery? 435 West Mission Boulevard. So for delivery? And yes. That was your phone number, hon. The number is 909 595 2264. I'm sorry, one more time. 505. 909 595 2264. West Mission Boulevard. We'll meet you here. Excuse me? 435 West Four Mission Boulevard? Yeah. That's what Where it is. Where are you, hon? Thank you very much. Where are you, sweetheart? Uh, I'm right across the street. I'm right across the street. Mm, 435 West Mission Boulevard? That's pulling up in California. So Excuse me? I got something. That's pulling up in California, so I think I don't have the right address there. No. Boy, sick. Now that's not me. Okay, so 435 West Mission Boulevard? Yes, I know. That's... Uh, what's your zip code? Excuse me? Your zip code? Why are you so mad at me? I'm just trying to figure out where you are, sweetheart. That address pulls up in California. So what's your zip code? Uh-huh. Is this your way of getting out of your responsibilities? Are you, excuse me. Are you in California? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> what's your zip code, sweetheart? I'm 72 years old, and I've fucked up every uh, every relationship I've ever had. 
sorry to hear that, but I can't seem to find your address, so I'm going to need the zip code so I can do a little bit more investigation here. Okay. 320-362. That's what it is. 320-362. Are you in California? No. I don't believe any of this. What is your That's zip code? That's not good Mr. information. Mr. Okay, then what is your zip code? I just told you. 320-362. That is not a zip code, honey. Zip codes are five digits. 320 362 That is not a zip code, honey. Zip codes are five digits. Don't deliver there anyway. Stop wasting store time. Excuse me? Huh? <laughs> You're very rude. You're very rude. Wasting store time. She was having fun. Why have they got to do this, guys? They got to ruin our fun. Hello, can I help you? Hello. Hello. Is this your way of getting out of your responsibilities? Excuse me. I I, I don't understand why you're so mad at me. Excuse me. Excuse me. You and I have gotten along fine, and I don't know why this is happening. Why, what's happening, sir? You just called my shop. Yes. To pepperoni with extra cheese. Did, is that something you want to do? Yeah, no, you have a good night. Please stop calling, okay? Thank no. you. All right, homie. Why are you doing this? <laughs> angry. I had this place saved as Angry Pizza. What's up, Lex? I had this place saved as, ang as Angry Pizza. I think... Do you remember that one where the guy was like, Fucking come here! Come to the store! Fucking fight me! <coughs> I think it might be that one. I think that was the guy in the background, maybe. Hello? Yeah. Why are you acting okay. like this? Stop calling, please, sir. We are busy and we have stuff going on. Fuck it, let's call him again. <coughs> so what the hell were you thinking? Who just subscribed? Crit5 has subscribed. Thank you, Crit. Pizza. Hi. This is Fred. Uh-huh. You have nothing better to do on a Friday? That's pretty damn pathetic. Can you stop calling us? <laughs> uh-huh. Let's business. start this Hi. again. To pepperoni with extra cheese. <laughs> I'm sorry that I ear raped everyone. The viewers went down. I did that. Can I get some help, please? Uh, right, let's reconsult the peeps folder. Angry pizza. Funny gay guys who are there. Yeah, that was angry pizza. Oh, this is the one with that Mexican girl. They got really, got really freaked out. Like, oh my god, you can't say that. You're being racist right now? I gave you like five pizza places. Did you? Oh, on Twitter. Oh, my mic nearly fell on my crotch. That wouldn't have been good. Oh, I gotta post this stream on Twitter. Okay, I doubt they're picking up. I must. This my number must be banned from every pizza place.
Hey, no mas papi. No mas papi. Donated Terrific. 9.99. Damn. Thank you, bro. Coho. Coho. There's a few extra bucks. Thank you, Lex. I appreciate that, homie. All right, homie. All right, homie. I appreciate that, man. Coho. Can I help you? This is Fred. Fred? Yeah. This is Risa Pizza. Can I help you? Yes, I know. That's Yeah, I'll take the pepperoni with extra cheese. Pepperoni extra cheese? Do you know what size you want? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. What size pizza? It's 20 bucks. You're Hello? Just looking for a pizza. Uh, can you hear me? Hold on one second. <laughs> so you want, do you know what size pizza? Or you're saying you have 20 bucks and you want a pepperoni with extra cheese? Yeah, please. Finally, she understands. That's what it is. It's 20 bucks. Yeah, it's $19 for pepperoni pizza. Uh-huh. Or a large one, right? Okay. So, for yeah. it take, uh, how long? 25 minutes? 30? 25 minutes. Let me get a phone number. Tw 25 minutes, okay? Yeah. Thank you very what's, much. What's your, what's your phone number, Fred? The number is 909-595-2264. Okay. We'll see you here in about 25, okay? Thank you very much. Thank you, bye. All right, homie. All right, homie. All right, homie. Uh, did someone donate? Hey, Eric, Canadian. Eric. Hang on. Eric, uh, open apostrophe, Canadian gold boy, close apostrophe, gray donated. Oh, Sorry, I'll come back. Hello? Hi, this is Risa Pizza. You just called us right now for our large pepperoni? Yeah. yeah. Okay, so you know we're in Upland, California. Uh huh. Okay, just want to make sure because I saw your area code is like um, Miami or something. Oh. <laughs> I'm right across the street. Oh, Fred from the fireman? Fire yeah. Fireman? Okay, Mario knows you. All right. Uh huh. Here. Thank you. Okay, bye. <laughs> I got a fit next time that Fred the fireman comes in, he's not gonna be very popular. I got a feeling. Um <clears throat> Right. Uh oh yeah. Eric Canadian Goldboy Grey. Uh six ninety nine Canadian A <laughs> It's an Australian next to uh, I just sent an email. You did indeed. I donated on your live chat. If you can call from an Ohio number, it would be great. Uh, also, if you could use if you could use Kimball, uh, I assume you mean Arnold, not not me, um, Detective John Kimball, uh, and that young sounding kid cop Eric. What? Who do you mean by young sounding kid cop? Do you mean um, Deputy Martin? Or someone else. Let me know in chat, bro. <clears throat> I'm bulking Kimball's in the pizza my way. I was going to say, send me your address and I'll order some pizza. That's not really a prank. Cause you, I guess you'd still have to pay for them. Um. See, you're saying like poor, poor lady gonna make a pizza for no one, but like, what I assume is that at the end of their shift, the fucking I bet all the employees just share out the pizza. They probably like it when there's a no share. 
Like, I guess it's annoying to make it if it's really busy, but, like, you know, it's a free pizza, I'm pretty sure, right? Deputy Martin and the cop, the cop Kimball from Cleveland. Do you, Eric, do you mean, hang on, I'm a little bit confused. Do you mean this guy? Okay, this is, a, okay, this is <laughs> Officer Ed Powell with the Cleveland Police Department. Do you mean that guy, Eric? Or do you mean me when I, when I was pretending to be from Cleveland yesterday? Do you mean that kind of thing? I literally eat free pizza almost every day, just asking if they have messed up orders. Explain more, Dark Messy. This seems like a money-saving life hack. I got so many pizza places near me. I got like three on my street, man. If you tell me how, if you tell me how to get a free pizza, bro, that's that'd be sick. <coughs> yeah, sorry that guy. Yeah, okay. Yeah, sorry that guy. Okay. Um. Deputy Martin and the Cleveland Cup. Uh, let's go back to what I was doing. Hey, um, no mass puppy lives noy. Oh fuck, are they open? They're not open, are they? Lex lives next to Hotel Surfer. Uh, right, more pizza places in Upland. Nine 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 six one. That's different. Yes. Yeah, <coughs> Put you on hold for just a second, all right? Wow. Is this your way of getting out of your responsibilities? Is this the way you act? Uh-huh. Go ahead. Boy, sick. <laughs> <coughs> Jesus. Dude, just stop by the place during di dinner. Ask if they have extra stuff. Here in USA, people are always messing up orders. Do you know what? You literally just go in and ask if they have any messed up orders. Damn. We'll wait like a minute or two to see if this guy uh, picks up. I might actually try that dark matter. But it might be all like the shitty pizza, the horrible flavours no one likes. At Domino's in the UK, you can get a fucking like curry pizza, man. It looks fucking disgusting. Who wants that apart from Indian people? <laughs> and probably not even Indian people want it. <laughs> not even those fuckers, nearly anything. <laughs> Numbers from Wolf. This guy's. M oh no, he's not. Hi, hello. Hi. Still there? Hi. Let's start this Talking again. Officer. Yeah, I'll take the pepperoni with extra cheese. All right, is that gonna be for pickup or delivery? Fourth. Excuse me. For pickup or delivery. Go. Oh. <laughs> One forty-seven North Euclid Avenue in Upland. Uh, have you delivered with us before? Uh, yeah. Alright, can I get the phone number, please? The number is 909 might have a note 595 like, no, sure. 2264. Okay, for Scott, right? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Almost Scott. And yeah. you said what size? It's 20 bucks. Okay, but what what was the order? Like, what what pizza did you want, sir? To pepperoni with extra cheese, please. Okay, but what size? It's twenty bucks. Come on. Twenty bucks. So, do you want the fourteen inch? Yeah. All right, and you said pepperoni and extra cheese, right? Uh huh. Thank you. Anything else? Uh. No. 
Well, sir, you have to order something else. So the the limit for it is twenty dollars. Like you have to, the order has to be more than twenty dollars, and the order is only nineteen ninety two right now. Okay. So you gotta add something else. Cocaine. <laughs> Sorry, sir, we don't we don't we don't carry that here. Uh huh. Boy, sick. That's not good information. <laughs> How much? It's still at nineteen ninety-five. Uh-huh. What else can I add? Walnut. Sir, we don't carry walnuts here. With extra pepperoni. All right, I'll just add extra pepperoni on that pizza. Yeah. Go ahead. All right. Thank you. No problem, sir. Delivery time will be around an hour, all right? Yes, thank you very much. No problem, sir. All right, homie. All right, good night. <laughs> See, we, we had an amicable ending after we, uh, after he tried to get out of his response for this. All right, Eric Canadian Gold Boy Gray. If you can call from an Ohio number, it would be great. Uh, yeah, I can't. I can only call from Miami, but no one ever questions it, really. Actually, that's a lie. They always question it. But hey, it might... It won't matter. Uh, okay, Eric Koenig, Goldboy Gray, leave, leave, leave this to the experts, yeah. Uh, I cleaned up my PC today with all the dust. It's running faster. So, that's good. thought you guys might want to know that. Uh, Ed Powell and Deputy Martin. Uh, I'm fine. This is Officer Martin from Sheriff's Department. How can I help you this evening? Oh, I'm sorry, Eric. He doesn't seem to be picking up. Into an automated voice messaging system. Oh, Eric, bro. I'm sorry, my friend. You can even just call in an order, then cancel it like 30 minutes later. Wait an hour. Stop by to ask for the... Damn, that is a life hack. That's like... A, that's not an ethical one. If you're if you're in a real stitch, then I can that could that would probably work. Uh, this is Congress Pizza. Thank you for calling the new Congress Pizza. On yeah, say, send me another one, Eric. West Grand Avenue. Just email it. Please stay on the line, and your call will be answered in the order that it was received. Please hold a moment. <laughs> <laughs> Aww. Congress, what can I help you? Okay, this is a, okay. This is Officer Ed Powell with the Cleveland Police Department. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm gonna call back just so we get put on hold. Thank you for calling the new Congress Pizza on 3737 West Grand Avenue. Please stay on the line, and your call will be answered in the order that it was received. Please hold a moment. Congress, what can I help you? Uh, well, the, you know, and uh, listen to what I'm saying. We have two calls from this number, okay? Hello? I'm not, I'm, okay, this is Officer Ed Powell with the Cleveland Police Department. Uh, we're trying to see who's this individual that's calling the station here. Um, this is uh, Pizzeria. We're in uh, Chicago, Illinois. Okay, I don't know. We just received several phone calls from this number. I meant to okay. be using Leave friend. Leave lewd and lascivious remarks, not only to did. us, but for the captain and the lieutenant here. Sorry, muscle memory kick then. Oh, nobody's calling from this, from over here. Yes, and it was, sir. We have it on tape that, that we had two calls from this number. That's why we called you back. I'm not a sir. I'm a ma'am. 
Yeah, we heard you, sir. Okay, who's calling this number? Who's calling us here at this district? That's what we want to know. I wonder if I call back with Fred if they... Thank you for calling the new calling the new Congress. Fuck West Grand Fuck Please stand up, please on the line and your call will be answered in the order that it was received. Order received. Oh my god. It's like Blade Runner. <laughs> Hello? Hello? Yeah, I'll take the pepperoni with extra cheese. Uh. Sorry? Yeah, I'll take the pepperoni with extra cheese. It's not going to work. I hope that's not on my end. Thank you for choosing Bocce Pizzeria at Chicago Avenue location. For a quicker way to get your order in, go to bocchipizza.com and place your order online. You can view our menu, check out our specials, and sign up for a rewards program all at bocchipizza.com. For delivery, please press 1. For pickup, press 2. For private... I want delivery. Hi, this is Fred. Hello? Yes? Yeah, I'll take the pepperoni with extra cheese. Okay, that's it? Yeah. Thank you. The fuck? Uh, LA, oh fuck, LA Villa Pizza also in Chicago. Great pizza, apparently. I'll call, call your number after this, Eric. This is Fred. Yeah, I'll take the pepperoni with extra cheese. Um, I'm sorry, pick up or delivery? Uh, 147 North Euclid okay. Avenue. Uh, pick up or delivery? Yeah, downtown Trump Towers. There's Trump Towers in Chicago. What a fucking... St I hate... This is what I was annoyed at before on the 24-hour one. I hate when... Like, people can't make the most fucking basic of inferences. She's like, I'm saying, I'm a, I'm a confused old man that's saying an address. And, she, and she's still, she's like, pick up a delivery. Pick up delivery. Like, I have to, you have to hear the word delivery. I'm giving you a fucking address. Of course I want delivery. Let's call her back and just whistle. <laughs> turn down, turn down your headphones. I'm going to whistle this bitch. This bitch is going to get the whistling of her life. Hello? Hello, Lower, can I help you? Hi. Hi, is this going to be for pickup or delivery? Yes. I'm sorry, pickup or delivery? Listen to this. <laughs> oh, fuck you. I'm going to wring your fucking neck. I know where your parents and family live. I'm going to put it in to you. Uh, I'll save that number to call back with Ed Powell in a little bit. Because they might they might uh, infer that it's Fred that he's looking for. And who knows, hilarity might. Uh, well, Will is here. Okay, this is your, this is your number. Uh, who? Uh, Eric Canadian, Goldboy Gray. Hello. Okay, this is... A Okay, this is Officer Ed Powell with the Cleveland Police Department. Yes. Uh, we're trying to see who's this individual that's calling the station here. From where? Uh, uh, we're trying to see who's this individual that's calling the station here. I don't know. 
Okay. I don't know. We just received several phone calls from this number, okay, leaving lewd and lascivious remarks, not only to us, but for the captain and the lieutenant here. No, it's not from my phone, sorry. It's what? It's not from my phone. We have two calls from this number. No, sorry. I so have the listen, to what I'm, so listen to what I've been taping from this number, okay? Good afternoon, Cleveland Police. Hey, Chum Guzzler. Cleveland Police, can I help him? Really worship my cock. Got it in my head. <laughs> you can tell she's slamming that there. <laughs> Your call is not forwarded man, we... to a voicemail service that is not not been set up. Yeah, yeah, I've heard it all before. Tell me something new. Right, I said, oh, I haven't seen this up in the pizza place, or at least I don't remember it. Hello? Hello, Fratello. This is Fred. How are you? Hi, uh, what can I give you? Yeah, I'll take the pepperoni with extra cheese. How, how big do you want it? Yeah. <laughs> how big do you want it? Oh, <laughs> it's twenty bucks. Uh, I'm sorry. You do you want a large, a small? Yes, medium? please. Twenty dollars. Uh, I'm gonna have you talk to my boss, man. I can't understand you. Uh huh. Oh, you retarded! How is it this difficult? Hello, can I help you? Hello, this is Fred. <laughs> Hey, Fred, what can I do for you? Yeah, I'll take the pepperoni with extra cheese. What size, Fred? It's 20 bucks. It's it's 20 bucks? Yes. That's what it is. Thank you. Uh, you're talking about... You're talking about the cost of the pizza? Yeah. It's twenty three forty nine plus tax. Yes. Uh, Thank actually, you. Actually, it's twenty five ninety nine plus tax. Thank you very much. Did you want me to go ahead with it? It comes out to twenty-eight dollars. Yeah, please. L let me get your let me get your phone number, Fred. Please. The number is nine zero nine five nine five two two six four. Okay, I got a uh, a large pepperoni, extra cheese. Fred, give me about twenty minutes, please. We do close at eight thirty. One forty-seven North Euclid Avenue in Upland. Uh, we don't deliver. Okay. Is that is that what you're looking for? A delivery? No. Okay, you gave me your address, so we're at sixteen sixty seven North Mountain Avenue. Uh huh. Yes, I know. That's why are you so mad at me? Hold on. I'm not mad at you. You just said an address to uh, Euclid, and you're getting me confused. We, I'm telling you, we don't deliver. Uh, you're telling me that you're going to pick it up, so I don't know why you're telling me that address. Oh, <laughs> why are you so mad at me? Is this your way of getting out of your responsibilities? That was a misclick. Is this the way you act? Fred, would you like me to go ahead with this pizza, yes or no? Yes, please. I'll be 20 minutes. Thank you. Uh-huh. Thank you very Bye. much. Bye-bye. All right, homie. All right, homie. God, he got it. How can you not understand what I'm... Am I in the wrong, man? Am I in the wrong? Because I feel like if I went to a pizza place and I heard an old man call and I said, what size do you want? And he said, it's $20. I'd instantly know, oh, he wants, he wants one around $20. Every pizza place has like a 1999 to like 25 range pizza. You're always going to have that. And if not, just upsell. Like, fucking get get some fucking bonus points from your manager. Like, how retarded can you be, man? So retarded. <laughs> I 
All right, mate. Oh, wolf. This person killed my cat. Let's call him with Ed Powell. He'll he'll find out what's been going on. If that's true, I'm sorry to hear that. Rest in peace, Wolf's cat. The next train tries to mix lines. He says, uh, I'll take the $20 pepperoni with extra cheese. To an automated voice messaging system. Uh, Wolf. Wolf, bro, every number you sent me hasn't worked. And that's not a dig on you, I'm just saying. Yeah, Wolf used to send me good numbers. Same with um, Harry Penis. Is he here? He usually sent every number he sends me is usually gold, but yesterday, oof. Don't know what was going on. He just went he went hitting like they used to, man. Just went hitting like they used to. I can't bring it, I bring one the Is there a clip of Fred saying large? I dunno. If someone knows if there is a clip I could use for it. I'm gonna edit that line you suggested, uh Feral Farmer. What's um? What did you suggest? I'll take the twenty dollar pepperoni with extra cheese. Okay, I'll I'll take the twenty dollar pepperoni with extra cheese. Uh. Maybe this will save fucking retards. You know, I'm annoyed. Because I shouldn't have to do this, guys. We shouldn't have to live like this. We shouldn't have to go through this. I should just be able to say $20 and people would understand. Uh, I sent you some bullshit numbers. Go on, do it. Don't be scared. Uh, we'll call them in a bit. Unjustly jailed. You haven't... Uh, sent in for a while. I just yelled. Welcome back to the stream. J Song. Pizza Hut. Thank you, Ryan. Um, Pizza Hut. And, uh, right. Okay, we'll call them. I'll put them on my list. And then. Oh, hang on. Lex's numbers. Uh, let me get Twitter open so you just have a list so we're constantly going so we don't have pauses like this. So you don't like pausing. It's bad for a stream. Bad for a stream, Elf. Say it, bring bad luck to stream. You've got a flesh away the evil. Classic victim. I love... Uh, the numbers from this encrypted email address are always so good. I sent one your way. Did you, Andrew White? Maybe I have it. Maybe I have it open, man. And every number that's been sent to me on Twitter, I've got open right now. So if you send it on Twitter, uh, I don't know if you emailed it somewhere. Via email. Oh, I'll I'll get to it in a sec then. All right. Is this? Yeah, that's rendered. All right. Um. All right. Let's create this line. Cause fucking retards. I know. What fucking money is. Uh. Yeah, I'll take the pepperoni with extra cheese. Twenty dollars. That'd be a good cash. Yeah, I'll take the pepperoni. Twenty dollars. Twenty dollars. Take the pepper. The pep. Pepperoni. Yeah, 
I'll take the twenty dollars pepperoni. With Yeah, I'll take the $20 pepperoni with extra cheese. $20 pepperoni. Maybe it's inflation. Maybe there are no $20 pizzas anymore. Especially not with extra cheese in this economy. Yeah, I'll take the $20 pepperoni with extra cheese. Okay, let's call these pizza place. They'll still ask for size, do you reckon? Charles Pizza. Oh, fuck. God, you didn't wait, mate. Have some patience, I'm an old man. Hello? Let's start this again. Yeah, I'll take the twenty dollar pepperoni with extra cheese. Uh, your name? This is Fred. Okay. You want medium pepperoni, double cheese? Is it? Yeah. Thank you. Got the Indian guys. Double cheese. Do you know how to get here? Uh, one forty-seven North Euclid Avenue in Upland. We'll meet we you here at the we, office. We, we, we don't deliver, sir. You have to come and pick it up. Uh-huh. Okay. So, do you know how to come here? To yes. Come? Yeah. Do you, know our ad do you know our address? I'm right across the street. Okay. Uh, across the street from us? Yeah. Petrol is speed, right? Uh-huh. That's what it is. Yes, I know. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> okay. Pepperoni double cheese for Fred? Yeah. yeah. Okay. All right. Thank you very Thank you much. Okay. All right, homie. <laughs> so the fourth or fifth pizza. Right, let's hit this pizza hut. <laughs> oh. This is a pizza hut in a r not in Walnut. Where is this one? The number's nine and nine. Five nine five two two six four. Smithville MO. What state is MO? Montana? It is Missouri. Ah. What's Montana then? I don't know. I'd guess MN, right? Calling Pizza Hut. All calls are recorded for quality assurance. Este llamado está siendo grabado por propósitos de calidad. If you love pizza and being around MT. it as much as we do, why not apply for a job at Pizza Hut? The fuck is it MT? We're looking for someone just like you. We have positions available from cooks, cashiers, and delivery drivers. Fuck. Hi, thank you for calling Smithville Pizza Hut. My name is Kaden. How may I help you? Hello. How are you? Hello. How are you? Just fine. Let's start this again. She's not going to get Yeah, it. I'll take the $20 pepperoni with extra cheese, please. We are actually closing at 10 tonight. 
okay, is this your way of getting out of your responsibilities? <laughs> is this the way you act? No, it's because of the weather and the roads, and we have employees that need to get home. Boy, 11. sick. Why are you so acting like this? All right, have a good night, sir. How long have you been on the job? Oh, you don't get away that easy. Oh, no. Who do you think you are? I'm not going to deny Fred is pizza, bitch. <coughs> Blinky time. All calls are recorded for quality right, assurance. Right, they shut 10. Este like, like, why even... Por propósitos de calidad. If you love pizza and being around it as much as we do, why not apply for a job at Pizza Hut? We're looking for someone just like you. This guy sounds we like he's going to molest you. I wouldn't apply for his job. Drivers Fucking hell. Positions. It's a fun, fast-paced, you love rewarding, pizza and supportive environment with flexible. Hello? Hi, this is Fred. Fred? Yeah, I'll take the pepperoni with extra cheese. Oh, I'm sorry, sir. We're closed. Why are you acting like this? Acting like what? Um, I apologize, sir. We closed early because of the weather. Wow. Is this your way of getting out of your responsibilities? Yeah, have a great day, dude. Listen to this. You're talking to an older gentleman here who doesn't hear it that well, and you're speaking in a... 708-395, City Tap and Grill. Do you remember the video of that guy saying, Rest in Peace, Fred Herbert? Do you know, it sounds kind of familiar. But... It sounds familiar. This is probably bad karma for me because I still need to go home from work. No, we're, um... Our karma's fine because we're uh, giving the employees free pizza. And also, some of these some of these fuckers are so rude to an old man. They fucking deserve this shit. I think we're on this. We're, God, God is acting through us, you know. Through the soundboard. Intelligence agency. Against soy. Hello? Hello. How are you? Hi, I'm good. How are you? Just fine. Do you remember me? No, I don't know who this is. Let's start this again. I'm 72 years old, and I've fucked up every uh, every relationship I've ever had. Uh-huh. I've been a bellbindsman for... 46 years and a cop before that for four or five years and so I mean I think I've seen it all so what's going on excuse me you've been a what for 46 years I've been a bell bindsman for 46 years and a do you want to know what the <laughs> bell bind business is all about sure if you're sentenced and you're in prison, <laughs> what perfect you just have your time to do. Bail is a <laughs> bail is something that you can post while you're fighting your case. Oh, okay, got it. Now there could maybe be bail by appeal. That would be something that'd be have to be set by an attorney. Right, right, right. Sometimes it's an advantage for somebody to be out so that they can fight their case and not be in custody. That's what it is. Right. So what's going on? Nothing. You know you called a restaurant? Yeah. Where do you work? I don't know if it's a matter of woman. This is City Tap. We're based um, in a suburb outside of Chicago. Wow. And how long have you been on the job? About uh, maybe six months or something. Wow. I'm 72. I don't know how old you are. Yeah. Oh, I'm 18. Wow. <laughs> yep. 
I had sex with a minor. Aggravated sexual assault with a child under the age of 14. Innocent till you're proven guilty. <laughs> Hello? Hello? Yeah. Can I get some help, please? Yeah, how can I help you? Listen to this. I fall in and I can't get up. Sorry? Uh, yeah, you know, I fall in and I can't get up. And there's no life alert. I can't quite hear you. It's really loud over here. Is this your way of getting out of your responsibilities? Is this the way you act? What? Excuse me? I'm sorry. I can't hear you too well. There's a lot of things in life that don't make sense. True. Yeah. It's been a mystery to me. So do you have any questions? I don't. Wow. Why are you acting like this? <laughs> what do you mean? Do <laughs> you think it's because you're Mexican? Me? I'm not Mexican. Yeah. <laughs> I don't believe any of this. Oh. They're saying that it has nothing to do with race. I don't know. Wow. <laughs> oh, all right, well, I got to get back to doing some stuff, all right? You take care, all right? Uh-huh. All right, homie. All right. See ya. Bye-bye. Bye. That was a pretty interesting phone <laughs> call. <laughs> Oh, God, what a strange phone call. Sup, Bodhis, Bodhisattva 3.7. Uh, I apologize. What's up? This Kush plus Kimball Live. Really hits different. Hell yeah, bro. Hell fucking yeah. I can't believe I actually had the opportunity to um, explain what the bail bonds business was all about. That was uh, pretty cool. That's the most exciting thing that's happened to me all day. I do. I we make fun of soy boys and funk collectors, but I got so excited then. That is like uh, that's how um, that's how soy boys feel, and like a new Funko Pop is released. I imagine <laughs> when all the women team up in the Marvel movie. Calling Pizza Hut. All like, calls are recorded for quality assurance. Let the girls Dude, that's fucking epic. And being around it Fuck. As as we do, that's so cool. Why not apply for a job at and then they fucking, we're looking and then they, for someone they fucking just teamed like up you. and use that energy we have together to defeat from cooks, the, cashiers, the guy. And delivery drivers to management positions. It's a fun, fast-paced, rewarding, and supportive environment with flexible scheduling. We'd love to have you on our team. Just go to hutjob.com and apply today. That's H U. I can't be asked. Sorry to have sent that in. But you didn't even pay, so fuck you. It was a dirty Twitter number. Right, let's call some of these Lex ones. This this isn't a Lex. No, it's not. Hello? Hello, this is Fred. Hello? <laughs> Don't know who this number is. Hello? 
Save your message for 9789678585. What do you want it back? Thank you, Kimball. Hello, JJ. Seven six. Hey, did that work? Oh, hang on. Lexus numbers. Fucking hell. Right. Hang on. Oh. Hello. Hello. Yes. Hi. How are you? Who is this? This is Fred. Fred? Yeah. You got So what's now. going on? No, Who I did not. I'm sorry, who's you looking for? Excuse me? Who are you looking for? Uh Excuse me? Oh, fuck, I couldn't find the line I wanted. I screwed that up. God damn it! to an automatic voice message system. Eight, Sorry. One, eight. Right, next one. Hello. Hello, this is Fred. How are you? Uh huh. Hello. Do you remember yeah, me? There. No. Do you remember me? Wow. Let's start this again. My name is Fred Gordon Herbert. Okay. Can I get some help, please? For what? Excuse me. Help for what? What help do you need? Your Talking to an older gentleman here who doesn't hear it that well. You're really going to have to speak up. What is it that you need, Fred? I've fallen and I can't get up. And there's no life alert. Please. Come over to check to make sure we're okay. Yeah, it dropped. I've fallen and I can't get up. Okay. I come over to check to make sure we're okay. Please. And there's no life alert. Okay, where are you? I'm right across the street. You're calling the wrong person. Excuse me? Where do you live? What city? Is this your way of getting out of your responsibilities? Is this the way you act? Do you even know who you're calling? Okay, this is a, okay. This is Officer Ed Powell with the Cleveland Police Department. Yes. Uh, we're trying to see who's this individual that's calling the station here. I don't know. I don't know. We who's just had. Calling you. We just had. We just had uh, several phone calls from this number. Okay, and Which the number? individual ha and we're leaving Lulu. Say again, sir. What number is calling you? Yes, and it was, sir. We what have number? it on tape that, that we had two calls from this number. That's why we called you back. Okay, I haven't called anybody. I, well, that, what city well, are you guys in? What well, state are you in? Well, that's why we were able to call you right back. What state are you in? This is the Cleveland Police Department, District Number Three, sir. Okay, I'm in California, so uh, I don't know who's calling. Okay, well, the, you know, and uh, sir, we're not mad. We're trying to find out who's calling us here in this I, district. I have no idea, sir. Okay, who's calling this number? Who's called calling us here at this district? That's what we want to know. You guys called me. I didn't call out. Who are you again? 
you guys called me. I didn't call out. Well, this so was called, called by us. This is the police that you're talking to. This is the, okay. you know, and who are you again? Who, who again, sir? I didn't identify myself to tell you who I was. Okay. You do realize that this is the police department that you're talking with. Okay, that's fine. Okay. Well, the, what we're having right now is we have uh, you know the folks Chris? listening to this conversation. As uh, we're listening to guy? you, listening to the, yes. you know the folks listening, and uh, we're listening to you right now. Okay, and uh, so listen to what I've been taping from this number. Okay. Good afternoon, Cleveland Police. Hey, come guzzler. Cleveland Police, can I help him? Really worship my cock. Got it you know in my hand right now. I'm getting hard. Balls rubbing against your chin. And before I come, I'm gonna squeeze your nose, and you're gonna take it all. Can you handle that? Of you can call. You can hang up on that it's call. Terrific. It wasn't for uh, my number, so I don't know who's been calling you. Well, that's why we were able to call you right back. Okay. Again, it wasn't from my number. Uh, Maybe yes, somebody's sir. spoofing. Maybe yes, somebody's sir. using a number. So but it's again, not from we my we're, we must tell you that you are being taped. That's fine. You can record me. I give you authority to record me. You okay. are okay. feel free to do it. Got, you're you're not calling right. from this right. number. Well, what we're having right now is uh, Lulu and lascivious folks calling us at the third district here. Okay. Uh, again, it's not from this number. Sir, so whoever again, we, you, that's whoever what we that called you back. Voice is, it doesn't, again, that's why we that were able voice. to contact this okay, number right back. Me? What do you want from me? What is it you're calling me back for? Sir, what we're not mad. We're trying to find out who's calling us here in this district. Okay, do you understand or do I have to repeat myself 60 times to you? It wasn't me. Uh, it wasn't from this sir, number. Do you want no, to I'm say li- it again? I'm, no, I'm listening. W- listen to what I'm saying, sir. Is there, is there anybody else that's calling? Nope. This is my personal phone. It's my hand. Nobody else. Okay. Now, do you realize, just like I said before, that this conversation is being recorded? And do you realize I told you ten times? Yes. Is what? I said yes. I understand. You can record. Feel free. Not from here. Well, what we're having right now is we have uh, the folks listening to this conversation. As uh, we're listening to you, listening to you know the folks listening the and well uh, the to this conversation and. you know, and this was called by us, and we have okay. the uh, the folks listening <laughs> that you're talking to, you know, okay. and, well, we're listening to you right now, okay? Okay, what do you want? What's the end, end thing of this? What is it you want? Tell me what you want. Uh, okay, who's calling this number? Who's calling us here at this district? That's what we want to <laughs> know. Again, for the five millionth time, Again, we don't know. Uh, sir, again, that's what we called you back, okay? I don't care what you did. I'm telling you, there's no one here that sir, called you. I'm not, I'm, sir, this is the police that you're talking to, okay? I don't care who you are. Okay. Do you listen and do to you me? realize, just I like I said before, you are. well, you're the, not, what we're having right now is we have the, uh, the mean folks that are, that, are, that are listening to you, and we're recording what you're saying. Very good. Feel free. Okay. Okay. Are y'all, are y'all listening to this? Now, you said you were who, sir? There's nobody here that called that number. There's okay, who is this I'm talking here? to right now? Doesn't matter. There's nobody here okay. on this property that has well, access the, to you my know, and, uh, I'm, and I'm, I'm, Well, is there, is there anybody else that's calling? Nope. There's one cell phone that's in my hand. Nobody else called Yeah, this is one of yours. So whoever What's your phone number, sir? Spoofing. What's your you phone number, me, sir? Right? You called me, right? Uh, well, you the, called me, you know, so you and, have my number. Uh, what's your phone number, sir? You have my number. You called me. So you should know what my number is. Hello? Yes. You know what? I've been getting calls all day long. What do you want? I wasn't the one calling you, sir. You're the one calling me, acting strange. No, sir. It is not coming from here. What number are you calling from? What's the number that you have on your screen that you've been calling, sir? Excuse me? What's the number that you've been calling, sir? You called me. No, sir, I did not. I don't even know a number. I don't know anybody in Florida. I don't have anybody over there. I haven't called anybody, sir. Stop these annoying phone calls. 
okay, whatever. Okay, this is Officer Ed Powell with the person? Cleveland Police Department. Well, the, you know, and uh, uh, I'm not, I'm we had two calls from this number. Okay, okay, who's calling okay. this number? Dude, you're gonna keep saying the same thing. I'm gonna keep saying the same thing. I no, don't know. it's not. So again, it's we not we, we you must tell you that voice? you are being taped. Does it sound like that voice? It's what? Do you hear my voice? Does it sound like the same person that's on your recording? So listen to what I've been taping from this number, okay? I don't care what you've been taping. You can hang uh, up. Why? Why don't you guys have it's a great what? night, okay? There's nothing no, here. Have a great night. See uh, you later. Bye. Well, that's why we were able to call you right back. What do you want? What do you want from me? Tell me what you want. Okay. You call me listen back. To what okay. I'm, what do you listen want? To, listen to what I'm saying, sir. Okay, who's calling this number? Who's calling us here at the Cleveland Police 3rd District? That's what we want to know. Okay, I'll tell you what. Give me one second. Okay. Give me one second. All right. What is your name? Uh, I'm fine. This is Officer Martin from Sheriff's Department. How can I help you this evening? What location are you from, sir? Deputy Martin from the Sheriff's Department. Sir, what's the? I'm, 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 I, I, I beg your pardon, sir. Trying to open a new sound booth. I was talking to Deputy Martin. What state, Deputy Martin? This is the sheriff's one. This is Deputy Martin from the sheriff's department. Well, you need to call, call what on here. What state? What sheriff's department? What state? Uh, I'm fine. This is Officer Martin from the sheriff's department. How can I help you this evening? What state are you from, Martin? Sir, this is this is the Cleveland Police 3rd District that you have. Okay, great. Hold on one second. Hold Who on. Who is this? Okay, and what is your name, the Cleveland Police? Okay, this is Officer Ed Power with the Cleveland Police Department. Ed Power, give me a phone number to the Cleveland Police Department, and I'll call you right back. Uh, is what? Give me the phone number to the Cleveland Cleveland well, sir, Police this is the number Department, that I just and I will called. call you back. I will call you back. Is what? The number. What's the number of the Cleveland Police Department? This is the police department that you're talking with. Great. What is the phone number there, sir? Uh, I'm not, I'm listen to what I'm saying, sir. Two one six six seven two. What's the phone number there? Well, the, what we have right time now is we have the, sound uh, the folks listening to this conversation. As uh, oh we're listening to you, God. listening to the, you know the folks listening, and uh, we're listening to you right now. Uh, <laughs> I fucking accidentally taped over the fucking not taped over, it, saved over the. I saved the Ed Powell soundboard to the. Ed Powell, old, uh, the, the Fred Samuels, the Ed Powell Samuels. So I, I wanted to play the Constable Arnold line. <laughs> oh, we were annoyed. Who was that guy, Lex? I laughed when he was like, um, I'm not, I'm talking to, to Deputy Martin, sir. <laughs> not you. <laughs> oh, hilarity. Someone donated, didn't they? But it what is that why three point seven on eighty nine ninety nine rupees? He said uh ah oh, powerful arm emoji destroy the soy welcome back Welcome back sir Oh fuck Are you are you calling here? Hello, this is Rita Pizza. I just wanted to let you know your this order's what? ready. Uh, I, I beg your pardon? Did you... Rita Pizza, we're waiting for you to pick up your order. Uh, okay, this is a, okay, this is Officer Ed Powell with the Cleveland Police Department. I'm sorry? Uh, uh, we're trying to see who's this individual that's calling the station here. Uh, somebody called from there to place an order. Is what? Somebody called us from this number to place okay, a who, pizza order. Okay, okay, who is this I'm talking to right now? Kenya. Okay, okay, who's calling this number? Who's calling us here at this district? That's what we want to know. 
it's it's a business. It's called Rita Pizza. Somebody call well, them from not, this number to place an order. We just so had uh, several to- phone calls from this number, okay? And the individual had, <laughs> and we're leaving the lewd and lascivious phone comes. He was saying how he wanted oh, to yeah, have I ordered it. See it. He also had other <laughs> things that was threatening the officers. That's why we were able to contact this number and call this individual right back. No, we didn't call you guys. This is a business. Somebody call us to place an order for this number. It's what? Hold on one second. Did you Sir, call? Did you call? Sir. Okay, who is this I'm talking to right now? This is Mario at Risa Pizza. Uh, you guys place an okay, order this? off of this phone number and for a large pepperoni pizza. Uh, I, said, I beg your pardon, sir? Spread. Huh? Uh, okay, this is a, okay, this is Officer Ed Powell with the Cleveland Police Department. Oh, my gosh. Okay, sorry to bother you guys because uh, uh, we just used the caller ID and just called the number back that that somebody called. Who are you again? We just returned a call from the number that was on our phone. Again, we 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 must tell you that you are being taped. Eh? Well, that's fine, but I I'm just so, trying to find out where so, this person is that ordered so, the pizza. So listen to what I've been taping from this number, okay? What? Sir, I'm not. I'm Listen to what I'm saying, sir. So listen to what I've been taping from this number, okay? Yeah, you're oh, from that number. You. I get it, but I'm, I'm going to ring your, your fucking order neck. Is what? Go sit under a tree. Uh, why? And I'm going to put it into you. I'm not, I'm what? Uh, okay. Are y'all, are y'all listening to this? <laughs> It's a crazy night tonight. Convert M4A to MP3. Right, let's just convert this uh, fucking... Why are they an M4A file? My ex-wife. Thank you for the donation, by the way, Body Bistai. I was reading it out in that guy called. Thank you. I like the ring saying that uh, text now has. Okay. Uh, this is ex my ex wife. Yeah. <laughs> it's been a mystery to me. What's your name on email? Mecca Lincoln. I call the tech guy. Oh, Cap. Where's Constable Arnold? Why can't I find Cash. Oh, Captain, you got uh, Constable Arnold over here. We're still recording the call, but I finished tracing it, and surely enough, it is, in fact, coming. Uh, Michael Lincoln, same name from the. Tra- what are you on about? From the 24 hour stream, uh. 
Oh, fuck me, Mega Lincoln. Sorry. Yeah, bro. Um, I got a man. Thank you so much for sending that. You're a fucking godsend. Because everything apart from, do you guys remember? Does anyone here remember the call where the dog jizzed in the bag? That's the one fucking call that I really want that I'm missing. I I have his. I have the guy's voice, but obviously I didn't record mine. So I was recording with calls without my voice on my end. So I didn't fucking save my voice. So I just have his responses. If anyone if anyone had recorded that call, no matter how shitty the quality is, if you're fucking talking over it, like uh please, please, please send me that call. That was one of the funniest calls I'd done in ages. I'm feeling a bit of uh I feel sad about it every time I find out. 24 hour stream now? Go fuck yourself. Alt Freight. <laughs> if someone donated $8,000, then I would, uh, I would consider it. If someone donated $24,000, that's my, that's the good donation goal. $1,000 for each hour. Uh, right, hang on, I'm gonna call back this guy. <laughs> I'm sorry, I can't get to the phone right now. Please leave your name. <laughs> God damn it. 24 hour stream was awesome. Yeah, I thought it was good, man. Oh, there were some really good calls in it. Uh, yeah, your ex wife didn't pick up, did she? Her new husband. Okay, this is a, okay. This is Officer Ed Powell with the Cleveland Police Department. Mhm. Mm uh, we're trying to see who's this individual that's calling the station here. Uh, it's not me. Uh. Okay, who is this I'm talking to right now? Uh, Nick. It's what? Nick. I live in okay. Arizona. I don't I'm know. Not even in that area. Okay, listen to what I'm saying, sir. Okay, I don't know. We just received several phone calls from this number, okay, leaving lewd and serious remarks, not only to us, but for the captain and the lieutenant here. Is that your ex wife? This is the police department this is the police that you're talking to. This is the Cleveland Police Department. I'm not. I'm not sir. I haven't been. I haven't called at all. So I'm. Not, I'm listening. W listen to what I'm saying, sir. We, we just had uh, several, several phone calls, calls from, from this number, number okay? okay? And the they individual had, and leaving we're leaving lewd, lewd and, and lascivious phone comes. He was saying how he wanted to have sex with the officers, and he also had and other things. He was threatening the officers. officers. That's, That's why, why we were able, able to contact this number and call this individual right back. JC, man, I know that annoys the fuck out of me. When Ed calls them and they're like, um, well, hang on, I live in uh, I live in Florida. It's like, bitch, you fucking, do you not think the police can call across state lines? Ed's, in Ed's mind, he's just calling the number back. He's just had a phone call from a random number and he's calling it back. He doesn't know shit about it. It's like, oh, it couldn't have been me because I'm in a different state. He's like, yeah, you have a phone number. Yeah, it's irrelevant what state you're in. So many retards around, aren't there? We're taking revenge on them. Slowly but surely. <laughs> Fucking Rita. Into an automated voice. Just annoys the fuck out of me. <laughs> it's ruining my life, yeah. Guillermo Herbert de Montoyo Joe Hernandez Goldfarb. <laughs> Bitch. Right, stripper. Drug lab? What? The fuck? Hello? 
Yeah, I'm from, I'm from the UK. Thank you for calling Calvert Laboratories. If you know your party's three-digit extension number, you may dial it now. To dial by name, press the pound sign. Press zero. Yeah, I don't know. If you know the extensions, send it over. <laughs> Mr. Inc Mysterious <laughs> Encrypted Number Giver. Oh my god! Who am I happy to see? Well, it's none other than Raper McGee. Hello, Hello, Larry. Oh, hang on. Okay, this is a, okay. This is Officer Ed Powell with the Cleveland Police Department. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> Get these legal immigrants out of here. Um. Hey, Raper McGee. Uh, yo, I forgot to. I was gonna reply. I saw your donation, bro, in the comments. Don't know what video it was. It might be in the live stream comments or the new video. But thank you, brother. I really appreciate that, man. Raper McGee, you're always so supportive in not only financially but in uh, with your kind words as well. I love you, Raper McGee, and I'll say it once I say it again. Uh, I don't know why. Listen, pe people just, um, they give you a bad rap just because you have the name Rape, because you have the word Rape in your name. <coughs> but you never see them, uh, what are the things called Rape? Rape seeds. <laughs> you know, so I mean, what I'm trying to say is thank you. What I'm trying to say is rape should be legal. That's what you should get from what I just said. And if you didn't understand, then you're not red-pilled enough. And you should leave. Okay. Oh, they picked up. Hello, you have reached the Getaway Lounge. As of yeah, right, the Getaway Lounge. I'm sure she is beautiful. Uh, hey, make a link. Well, you should let you post the rest of that 24 hour live stream. I'm posting it call by call, but no, YouTube didn't save anything, man. That, the YouTube original recording is gone forever. Because if it's over 12 hours, they just don't save it, which is very, very annoying. Terrific. Oh, what's terrific? Two terrifics. Colton Grundy, ten dollars for harassing his ex-wife's husband. Kimball, you are the ghost. Thank you. Terrific. Thanks, brother. I appreciate that a lot, man. Thank you very much. And Raven McGee, bro, you gotta slow down. I'm fucking draining. I'm like one of those, um, you know, uh, on Twitter, guys who have fetishes for girls like dr just draining their bank accounts. I'm like that with you, Raven McGee, bro. You're always donating. You gotta slow down, bro. But thank you, I do appreciate it very much. Give it a rest. Give it a rest for now, bro. There's another twenty four hour stream. If you do two twelve hours. Yeah, it would. But I don't know, that would have broken broken up the flow of the of the um of the stream, you know. Cause uh I feel like if I stopped halfway through and then like uh, everyone leaves and everyone has to come back but YouTube doesn't send the notification always especially if you do two live streams after another they wouldn't send I don't know I I have no regrets about how I did it apart from the fact that I lost that cool call dude I don't know if I'll do another 24 hour hey Macron did it Macron did it Oh, I, yeah, I also lost that bit. Although that's probably in what Mecca Lincoln sent me. I haven't combed through that fully. I'm doing it kind of cool by cool. Um, fucking... Rape him McGee, bro. I just saw you donate again. One. I'm not slowing down. Thank you, Rape. <laughs> so, I'm not slowing down. That's what you said to your... That's how you got your name. Uh, What was I talking... What the fuck was I talking? Yeah, yeah, I also, I don't know if I, I may have it, with a bit where I went on about Mac the Macron show. 
I said he. I alluded, alluded that he may be a paedophile. Because people in chat were talking about how he's a pedo. And then he looked like Gary Glitter, which was funny. He like looked exactly like Gary Glitter, the famous uh, paedophile. He got released. Oh, I think it was released on the day of the 24 hour live stream, actually. Gary Glitter. Knowing that they delete them, I'll be more careful recording. Listen, I'm the one who should be more careful recording. I should have recorded my voice as well. I just did not. In the OBS, in the streaming thing I use, you can record. You can save recording as well. But like a fucking like a an terrific an hour long stream is like is that the same? Yeah, that's Raper. Thanks, Raper. Um, an hour long stream is like uh like five gigs so i was i was literally worried that a 24 hour stream would fucking just fill up my hard drive and i listen i i need space to keep my child porn i can't be filling it up with kimball live streams how did how did macron do it man because he has ch macron has child porn and live streams he's clearly just better than me uh if you do a 24 hour stream, I will donate $8. Bro, uh, I'm not doing it because I don't want it. It just really fucking was hard towards the end. I knew, I kept like falling asleep at my desk. You know when you're in school in a boring lesson and you like, you doze off and then you yeah. like jolt back up? I kept doing that. When I was like, I don't know, I feel like I used to be able to stay up for for 24 hours I used to pull all nighters quite a lot but for some reason like just d d streaming at the same time and having to talk and make calls fucking tick it's like it's easier when you're just gaming or whatever but god it was so I just found it so hard towards the end I felt like ill which I guess was just me staring at a computer screen and the copious amounts of coffee I had yeah, thanks to everyone who stuck with it. There was quite a few people who were there, whose names were there, like, almost the whole way through. There's a live from start option I discovered, Roots. I used to use... Oh, shit, okay. I have a three-hour stream that's less than 400 MB. Yeah, I must have something... I must have it really high... It must be saving really high res or something. Actually, I won't look now. Right, we've been talking about child porn and rape for quite a long time, so I'm going to do a call. Um, the, someone's just sent this in with capital letters. CALL! So this better be good. You are right, Marley. I am the one who's been uh, bringing up the child porn. Oh, yeah, let's call this an alcohol addiction hotline. Actually, it's Macron that started it by being a paedophile. Uh, I'll tell you what, to finish the stream, because it's 5 a.m., fucking hell, I'm going to... Um, let's do a good old-fashioned Fred uh, on the brink of suicide call. They're all, they always cheer me up. Hello. Thank you for calling the Substance Abuse and Mental Health Services Administration's National Helpline for information on treatment and recovery support services. For English, press 1. Para Español, presione 2. Presione 2. If you find it's a call, call may be Spanish or recorded with for quality assurance and training purposes only. Please be assured any information you provide to SAMHSA's National Helpline will remain confidential. If you'd like to talk with someone about substance use disorder and Terrific. mental illness treatment and recovery support services, I'll read that out in a state, second, man. Press one. To speak with a national, please hold while your call is transferred to your state. In what state are you looking for information? I'm in California. I didn't. Un you said Maine. Is that correct? Uh, <laughs> yeah. Sure. Yes. Thank you. 
the fuck do you get main? Office is currently closed. Okay, I guess we don't have to worry about AI taking over just yet. The email says this is 24-7. Oh, thank you for calling the Substance Abuse and Mental Health Services Administration's National Helpline for information on treatment and recovery support services. For English, press 1. Para Español, presione 2. Uh, oh, 1. I'm sorry. Okay, your call may be monitored or recorded for quality assurance and training purposes only. Please be assured any information you provide to SAMHSA's National Helpline will remain confidential. If you'd like to talk with someone about substance use disorder and mental illness treatment and recovery support services specific to your state, press 1. To speak with a national representative, press 2. If you have questions about health insurance, press 3. What? I'm sorry, I didn't get that. If you'd like to talk with someone about treatment and recovery support services specific to your state, press or say 1. To speak with a national representative, uh, press or say 2. If you okay, have I missed that line. Please stay on the line while your call is transferred to a national representative. Thank you for calling SAMHSA National Helpline. How may I help you? Hello? Hello? Thank you for calling SAMHSA National Helpline. How may I help you? Hi. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Not so good. How can I help you, sir? Methamphetamine is ruining my life. Okay. Are you looking for treatment okay. facilities for substance abuse? Excuse me? Are you looking for treatment facilities for substance abuse? Yes. I'm 72 years old. Okay, so I can help by searching treatment facilities in your area. What is your zip code? Wow. I can't give you an answer on that. Okay, so I need some information from you in order to be able to look for resources in your area. Uh-huh. I've been a bell bondsman okay, so what for is your 46 years and a cop before that for four or five years. And so, I, I mean, want, I think I I've seen it all. With someone. Okay, sir. Um, are you, if you need me to look for treatment facilities, I need your city or your zip code. Yeah. The number is 909-595-2264. No, sir. I need your zip code. Oh, <laughs> I'm sorry. Hang on. Hang on just a second. Okay, I'm heading to my computer here. To... I'm going on my computer. The number is 320-362- that's what it is. No, sir. Your, your zip code. Your post yeah. Code. Yes, I know. That's that's what it is. Three two zero three six two. It's six numbers, isn't it? Because Miami's is like three one three three zero three. It's only a five digit code, sir. I'm sorry. Hang on just a second. What website do you have up? I'm sorry, sir? Excuse me? 
I need your zip code. Uh huh. Okay, sir. So I'm gonna have to disconnect this call. Have a no, good day. boy. Sick. Is this your way of getting out of your responsibilities? God. Is this the way you act? I suppose I was actually an alcoholic, man. What a bit. What a biatch. What a biatch, yo. Yeah. Is that how she fucking acts? Is that how she gets out of her responsibilities? Uh, oh, four minutes till two hours. We can get another call in before that. You fucking mysterious cryptid email, encrypted email man comes in clutch. Let's call him Meme. Mysterious encrypted email man. Meme. Meme comes in clutch with... Mexican gay bar. My two favorite, uh, my two favorite identity politics groups in the world, combined in one. And I love alcohol too. So this is a win-win situation. Help you. Okay, this is a, okay, this is Officer Ed Powell with the Cleveland Police Department. Uh uh we're trying to see who's this individual that's calling the station here. Okay. You think it's because you're Mexican? Help you. Okay, this is Officer Ed Powell with the Cleveland Police Department. Okay, who is this I'm talking to right now? Is this a legitimate? <laughs> is this spam? We have two calls from this number. Okay, this is, I don't know. We just received several phone calls from this number. Okay, leaving lewd and lascivious remarks, not only to us, but for the captain and the lieutenant here. Um, okay, hold on, hold on. Uh, okay. Hello? Okay, who is this I'm talking to right now? Uh, are you calling, are you calling for the Gay 90s bar? Uh, okay. I don't know. We just received several phone calls from this number, okay? Leaving lewd and lascivious remarks, not only to us, but for the captain and the lieutenant here. It's such a good Gay 90s bar. Um, I'm not sure. I mean, no one's really used this number, so this is, a, this is not a, a home number. I'm not, I'm, we just received several phone calls from this number. Okay. What number? Am I, what number? Who's, who does this number belong to? That, that, that who? What number are you calling from? This is, because that way this I can the, figure out who's calling, the, trying to call you. This is, the, this is the Cleveland Police Department, District Number Three, sir. The what police department? This is this is the Cleveland Police Third District that you have. Yeah, that, that, that Cleveland. You're calling about Cleveland, Ohio. Yes, and it was, sir, we have it on tape that, that we had two calls from this number. That's why we called you back. Okay, well, this is all the way across. The, if it's if Cleveland, Ohio, then you're calling, if someone's calling you from Arizona, I don't know who that would be. Well, the, you know, and, uh, well, this was called by us. This is the police that you're talking to. This is the, you know, and who are you again? Who, what, who again, sir? I'm just that she didn't, she couldn't hear you, so I'm, so I'm the one, I just I picked up the phone. Uh. Okay. But anyway, I'm just, not, I'm just trying to get. I'm, I'm just not, trying I'm to understand, to understand so I can explain to her who she was, who was calling. Sir, we're not mad. We're trying to find out who's calling us here this district. Yeah, I'm not sure. Uh, well, I'll I'm have her. Not, I'll I'm ask her who has been using li- the phone. But sir, I'm not. I'm listening. W- listen to what I'm saying, sir. We just had uh, several phone calls. From I don't think I played the long number, number, okay, and oh, the yeah. individual, ha- and we're leaving lewd and lascivious phone comes. He was saying how he wanted to have sex with the officers, and he also had other oh, things that were threatening name? the officers. That's why we, say again, sir? Uh, what, what is the number that he, here, I'm writing down the number. What's your number, what's your guys' number there? 216-672-4928. Two, 216 what? 672-4928. Hold on, I'm going to ask her who's called this number. Uh, let okay. Me check. Give me a second. Well, I'm not, I'm, okay. Bro, I'm getting deja vu. I've heard, 
We've had a call. We've called a gay bar before that went exactly like this. I don't know if I'm getting deja vu or if there actually is another call. Where we called, a female picked up the phone. She couldn't hear, so he put on to the manager. He asked for the number, I gave the number, and then he, he goes away with the number asking if, if she's called it. I'm getting like serious deja vu right now. We've definitely had a call ex like with this exact fucking sequence before, I swear. Does anyone remember it? Am I going nuts? Is what? <laughs> then what happens? Predict the rest. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> uh, all I know is I'm about to play the tape and they hung up. Or did they put me on hold? We'll see. Damn, I was having serious deja vu. I'm sure that exact fucking sequence has happened. From at like a gay bar. That was weird. Just because John read the receipt wrong. I might try one more. To 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 the gay nineties bar. Okay, this is Officer Ed Powell with the Cleveland Police Department. Okay, who's calling this number? Who's calling us here at this district? That's what we want to know. And they hung up. They probably searched up Ed Powell or something. That happens. They're crafty, those gays. Uh, J5, welcome. Bro, you've come right at the end, but welcome nonetheless. Right, I'm going to head off. I... That was a nice, another nice little stream tonight. I'm gonna. Oh, I fuck Robert Ross, bro. I forgot to read out your donor. Nine ninety nine. Damn. Thank you, brother. Um. Oh my Kimmel. You're reaching the legend levels of M McDung, M M McDuck with the timing and mixing of boards with that call of Fred Ed Det Martin, etc. I am not gay. Getting ready to mow the lawn. Uh, Robert Ross is a massive compliment. I don't think I'll, I'm quite at M. McDuck. He created the soundboard I use, so he's like, you know, the creators always has a special connection with their, their, uh, their technology. Uh, but that is a big, big compliment to me, Robert Ross. I really appreciate that. Okay, I'm gonna head off. I. Yeah, I'll I'll, mm, I'll very likely be streaming again tomorrow. I tell you what, I'll if I don't say anything on the YouTube community page, just assume I'm streaming. Uh, if I'm not, if I don't think I'll be able to, then I'll just say I won't. Uh, not that I don't. I don't know if anyone's planning their day around the Kimball live stream. <laughs> Maybe some of you are. Ray 